30 experience. <laughs> I've been hunting for years, but I ain't never seen dual horns with blood red tusks like those. So I guess I missed out. Dang it. Okay, so what's this glowy thing? Pick up fossil wood. Yeah. Oh man, that is a huge sword. That's a little sword. That's a Decently sized javelin. What do you want? What do you want? Be wise to rest up before we set out. Well, you are the wise one. Yeah, good idea. In You're so case, smart. Let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out in full force around here, huh? So they're the new crowns guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh, is it cool that we rock Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made them especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia on them. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So wear it with pride. Is this a camp? No, these are racks. Um, make a camp at Haven. So, I guess I just abandoned this guy with his stomach problems. Oh wait, if I change outfits, I change attributes? Uh oh. What do I change if I change what you wear? Okay, so I guess the actual outfits will change your stats. <laughs> so if I wear a jacket, I have more hit points. Does that make sense? If I take off my jacket, then I have more um, more sword and more flex, and I don't know what that is. More stick, hi. Um, this is the best stream ever, too, right? What's that stat? It's more, more stick. So we'll go with that, because this is the boy band look right now. But if you go really casual, then I guess you're really weak. Even if you take off your jacket. But you go formal, then you get like more, even more stats. Seriously. So I don't know. So I thought these casual clothes are really good, but if I'm looking at these stats, then they're not good. So now I have to rethink my whole dressing decision. Yeah, this is the very beginning of the game. I just 
well, you can see the elapsed time that I've been playing for 50 minutes, but I've um, spent some time playing around. I like did the tutorial for about like 10 minutes before I gave up because I wanted to actually start the game. I watched some of the cutscenes and took my time reading, and then I spazzed around, jumped around, and read some of the menus and stuff like that. So it's really only like 15 minutes of actual game time. Yes. I think it's way too hot for any of my boy band characters to be wearing a jacket. Maybe if you have a sleeveless vest, that could be okay. Because that's just too revealing, I think. Especially for Prompto. So. We're okay. We still look like we are a cohesive group, maybe. I don't know. Now the prince looks a little bit too plain. So there we go. I think we're fine. And the southern setting. Wait, so what's this elemental thing? So let's go on a detour. What's the sign? Is this like fossil? Ooh. So. If only. Oh, I have to hold down. I only took a little bit to figure out. I don't know. these particularly look like Oguri Shut. Maybe probably Noctis looks the most like him. But yeah, he's the best Japanese actor right now. No bias. Shall we camp here? We shall camp here. Um... What happens if I train? I don't know. It didn't. The tutorial doesn't tell me to train. I want to know what happens if I train here. So what happens? I'm going basic all out. Uh oh. Just don't get too carried away. Uh oh. I sure want to talk. Uh oh. Do I have a flashlight? Uh oh. Do I have to like fight you? No. Oh great. Oh, that's attractive. Ah! Oh no, the camera. I'm never gonna be glad of you. Maybe if I do that further. Okay, no. What am I doing? Oh, that did a lot. Maybe if I always do that. Hey look, I got an A plus on finesse.
That all you got, knocked? That is all I have. A whole lot more where that came from. There's not a whole lot more where that came from. It is very disappointing. But it's nighttime, yeah. so I'm, I'm all sticky and gross. Woohoo! Bath time! I don't see anywhere where you're gonna take a bath though. Oh, I gotta see. That's really sad. You're gonna see a lot of C's in here. <laughs> Ooh, so it's time to cook food. So I think the best stat food should be either the croque madame or the veggie medley stew, just based on the total number of things. So I think the stew might be a good one. I also like the level of advertising that's going on with those camping chairs. Like those Coleman folding camping chairs. I mean, where did we actually, where did they come from? Because we were walking around this little desert and we weren't carrying them at all. So who knows? Oh, and look at us. We're so cute. You can tell a lot about a personality by like how animated everyone, well, not everyone is, but like, um, Prompto is really animated. And then Ignis is very like proper with legs crossed. And like, I can't really see Gladio, but he's in the foreground, but he's like the dad. Now, I watched the, I watched the Brotherhood, the shorts. For the anime um, that they released every month, month like after they announced it, so it gave a lot of backstory, and it was actually really interesting. So I got my stat bump from eating the vegetable medley, so I'm happy. And I feel like this montage will go on forever and they'll have a never-ending bowl of stew. But I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, and then I'm pretty sure that for this you only level up um, when you rest for the night, so it's in your best interest to like go camp periodically. And you can only camp um, in certain places and that's the only time when you um, make the food as well so there you go and that's when I think um, during that montage that's when Prompto was taking those pictures too and I guess Gladio did something but I didn't notice oh so here's all Prompto's pictures we can look through them obviously all of Prompto's pictures are the best. Well taken. Well taken. Um, save. 